Hey everyone, this is Diana Rose. Welcome to my channel. I have a quick commentary on Miss Destiny Payton. She said she will no longer be silent. However, she is very selective on what she's choosing to be silent about you guys. I'm going to tell you all about it, but before I do, hit that like, subscribe, and your notification bell. That will help others find this video. And as always, I appreciate y'all for rocking with me. So let's get started. So if you missed my review for Saturday's episode of Love and Marriage Huntsville, please check it out. The link is pinned in the comment section. But in the review, Destiny and her cousin Demi hash out Destiny's meeting with Melody. Now during the meeting, Melody and Destiny seem to fall back in their old friendship. They laugh together. Destiny was chasing Melody around the studio. They looked like they were having a good time. But when they sat down to talk, Mel said that she was good in the space she's in right now and she did not want to revive the friendship. She said she just wanted her and Destiny to be in a space where they could go into a room together, see each other out and say, hey, that's it. Now, when Mel told Stormy and Tiffany what happened, she made sure to say that Destiny had invited her to the studio. But when Destiny shared what happened, she failed to say that she invited Mel. And I found that interesting since she was telling everyone on and off the show that Mel had not been invited to Madani. Well, y'all, it looks like some people on Facebook was just as curious and they were tagging Destiny asking, hey girl, what happened? And this is what she had to say. Well, since folk keep tagging me, here we go. As I stated before, I will no longer be silent with my truth. There are two ways scenes happen. Number one, production arranges it. Learn that the hard way, LOL, laugh emoji. Two, we contact one another and set it. Then production confirms. Fact, I didn't call anyone, nor did I invite anyone. You can ask the source why they presented it that way. Remember, this is a produced reality show. So I guess she was trying to clean things up when she said, there's only two way scenes happen. Production arranges it. Learn that the hard way, LOL. So all that huffing and puffing she was doing, saying that Melody wasn't invited to Madani was all a crock of you know what. Not to mention that Stormy recently set Destiny straight about Demi coming as her plus one. Destiny has been on this show for three or four seasons now, so she damn sure knows how production works. So her comment, I had to learn the hard way, like she's naive to all this, is confusing for me. Also, it doesn't matter for me that production set up the scene with her and Melody because what the cameras caught is that Destiny was just as giddy about being back in Melody's company as Martel was in that damn beach house. And you guys can check out my review to hear my commentary on that, okay? Not all of you caught that spaghetti reference. If y'all have old school parents and grandparents, they used to tell you to never eat spaghetti on your first date or the second one either, okay? If you know, you know. And if Destiny is truly choosing to not be silent, then I would love to hear her version of the story on these alleged text messages between her and Martel. But you guys, let me know what y'all think about all this in the comments. Like the video, subscribe to my channel, hit your notification bell, and I'll see you on the next one.